Uh, many years ago, in, in 1984 to be exact, a young man who was associated with the YMCA, uh, David Bedford, came to see me at my office in Lambeth Palace when I was working as uh, an assistant to the Archbishop of Canterbury. And he said, uh, you know, I think the YMCA ought to have a greater impact with young people who would never get near uh, a normal YM building. And so the idea of YCARE International was floated. I became the first chairman. And uh, when I was captured in Beirut, actually, the chairmanship was taken on by Robert Runcie, Archbishop of Canterbury, who stood in for me, believe it or not, in those years. But more importantly, across the years, we've had such a wonderful following from so many people, people such as yourselves, who've watched our progress with interest and who've supported us. I've often said I never think of our supporters simply as donors. I always think of you as partners, uh, partners in the task to try and eradicate world poverty and try and give young people a chance in life. Over the years since 1984, countless thousands have been helped and they've only been helped because of the partnership we've had and your generosity and support. And so this is just my way of saying thank you very much. Thank you for all you've given. Uh, all your prayers, all your support, it meant a lot to us. It still means a lot to us, but I'm sure it means even more to those young people who you will probably never meet and they will never meet you. But I can tell you one thing, they'll be glad that you were there to support them in a time of need. Thank you very much.